Russia is preparing for war in space. Threat to the US and Europe is increasing. The Russian Federation plans to place a nuclear weapon in orbit, which will destroy almost all satellites with a single explosion. But this country already has conventional anti-satellite weapons in orbit, killer machines capable of destroying other satellites one by one. Unlike a nuclear explosion in orbit, this weapon can destroy satellites one at a time, not all at once. The Telegraph writes about this. In 2019 and 2020, Russia launched a group of small maneuverable inspection satellites into low orbit. The Russians claim that the function of these devices is to rendezvous with other Russian satellites and check them to diagnose malfunctions. But, as the Telegraph writes, with the help of sensors and manipulators, these identical inspection satellites can interfere with the work of other people's satellites or even destroy them. Russian inspection satellites are usually short-lived. After a couple of years, they run out of fuel, lose altitude and burn up in the atmosphere. To maintain an orbital arsenal for a possible future space war, the Kremlin must launch a new batch of inspection satellites every few years, the Telegraph said. On May the 16th, the Russians launched a mysterious satellite called Cosmos 2576 from the Plesetsk Cosmodrome in northern Russia. Four days later, on May the 20th, Deputy U.S. Ambassador to the United Nations Robert Wood said that Cosmos 2576 was likely a weapon capable of attacking other satellites in low Earth orbit. Russia has deployed this new anti-space weapon in the same orbit as a U.S. government satellite. This American satellite, numbered USA-314, is reported to have reconnaissance capabilities, the Telegraph said. If Cosmos 2576 had attacked USA-314, it would have been an act of war. But in a situation where the battle has already begun, the priority of the Russian space forces would be to blind or disable as many American intelligence and communication satellites as possible. The Telegraph notes that the Americans also have inspection satellites and a secret space fighter capable of interfering with other countries' spacecraft, and so do the Chinese. The big difference is that the United States and China are not currently escalating a major war on the surface of the Earth that would demonstrate their recklessness. Сброс FPV дрона. Вот моя машина была. Полетела взад. Вот третья. Вот так и двигались. Ничего не осталось, все вещи. Все сгорело. Вот все, что осталось от нашего шашундоса. Скорел дотла. Минусы укрывались еще. Он еще дымится, блядь. Хотя почти 12 часов. Как оно все? Так вот. Поехали, пацаны наши. Повезли трехсотого в госпиталь и не доехали. Был один трехсотый, дала один трехсотый и два двухсотых. Без рыба катаемся. Давай это, пацаны. Ебачить надо плотно. Пацаны, давайте, чтобы без вас хоть видос остался. Приехал! Ну, курорт, конечно, такой себе. Звезды 4, я думаю. 